Hi. I have a super busy week ahead of me and there's just loads of fun things going on. So I thought this would be the perfect week to do a week in the life slash outfits of the week. Although I am feeling overwhelmed and I don't know how good of an idea it is to add something more to my plate this week but i thought i'd bring you guys along with me work is super busy we've got the sample sale on friday saturday and sunday and then we're doing our e-com and campaign shoot on monday and it's my boyfriend's birthday on monday and we've got lots of like fun weekend plans so buckle in okay i need to go to work but this is what i'm wearing sorry my room is messy behind me if you've watched my previous video you will have seen me talk about how i like the gray black and red outfit color palette this top i got from sharin outsource vintage she posted it on her instagram because it was supposed to be going up on her depop but i wanted to buy it it's actually on backwards but i prefer this little like neck keyhole detail at the front this skirt is fred perry i got it on vintage and then my vagabond loafers and then i've just got with me my mum's like mulberry um like satchel and then i've got my denim jacket somewhere it's Bench's birthday, it was a couple of days ago, but we're going to Campania tonight for dinner. And me and the girls have teamed up to get her the Kylie jumpsuit from Peachy Den. I hate to be the person that's like, don't talk to me before I've had my morning coffee, but I'm trying to film and I have not had my morning coffee and I'm really struggling. So let's get to work. Thursday the 5th and we are setting up the sample sale this afternoon that's going to be pretty hectic and it'll be all hands on deck and then I also need to do some sample sale promo content whilst I'm there and whilst we're setting up and then this morning will also be pretty hectic because it's the last time I'm going to be in the office until the shoot on Monday so I need to finalize all the moving parts pack the suitcases with all the, like the shoot samples and the accessories and like check all the digi cams are ready and good to go I need to make the shoot pack which is like the call sheet and the timetable and like printing off all the mood boards and the references and the packing list um so it's gonna be a busy day i'm excited to see the sample cell venue because i actually have no idea what it even looks like and i've never been to hoxton arches before and then tonight i'm just gonna come home hopefully finish editing a youtube video and then probably have a bath and go to bed so that i'm like well rested for the next couple of days i ordered this book that has honestly been in my amazon basket for ages it's called girl culture by lauren greenfield it's just got lots of like references on girlhood basically so i'm gonna have a flip through it this evening and take some photos of anything i can use as a reference and put it on the shoot mood board as well cute oh this is what i'm wearing today so i got this dress from shop yachts's store that's like just off of brick lane if you haven't been definitely go because she's got some incredible stock and then i've got on my diesel trainers i think i'm gonna bring my denim jacket just because it might get a bit colder later i know that i'm gonna spend my afternoon like shoving big heavy boxes so i'm probably gonna end up getting very warm okay i'm gonna head to work bye as expected yes it was so busy i actually don't know if i filmed anything and if i didn't i'm sorry i'm just heading off to the sample sale we've invited influencers and top customers to come for the first hour and a half before we open it to the general public. So I gotta go. This is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing a Fruity Booty top, 
and then Peachy Dan Debuska, and then these little cute Puma um, pumps that I got on Vinted for £12. Normally we wear like all Peachy Dan, but I thought because we were doing a collab event with Fruity Booty, I could do a collab outfit. <laughs> Gloria's outfit today. Gloria's shopping. She's not going to make any money this weekend. <laughs> Alice just spent £500. <laughs> okay, this could potentially nasty everything looked like it was covered in oil but i don't know it's lush to me <laughs> onya has the same bag as me yeah i literally nearly brought this bag today okay it's saturday and it is the second day of the sample sale it's supposed to be 24 degrees today but it's like warm but with a chill i am fully reliant on the weather forecast like i religiously check it every morning before i get dressed and if you're not in the sun it is still cold so I'm wearing suit trousers. I'm gonna give you a really quick outfit check and then I have to go because I'm running late. I'm going full court call mode today. I've got on my Peachy Den Lennox trousers, my Vagabond loafers. This sleeveless wrap shirt is from my mum's house. It's vintage. This really cute little necklace that my boyfriend got me for a birthday like ages ago. I need to go and grab an iced coffee on route because I'm super tired and some blister plasters. Let's go. Yasmin does not do candy. <laughs> I am so tired. I'm so tired. I've come home because I need to edit two TikToks to post on the Peachy account over the weekend just to promote the sample sale. And then I need to just go and quickly post some deeper borders because I haven't posted them since like Tuesday and I've had a really busy week, guys. I'm so sorry if you're waiting for them, but I've just been so busy. I've had like three or four coffees today and two Coke Zeros, so I feel like I'm fully caffeinated for this evening. We're going to Entee's Loft and then Fabric to see Midland and Peach for my boyfriend's birthday. So I'm very excited because I feel like there'll be lots of different friend groups in one place, which is nice because I can't wait to see everyone. I was like more on the door today. We were collecting one pound donations for Copperfield, which is a breast cancer charity because it is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. The people who say no to paying one pound for charity as a donation for entry to the sample sale, like that is bizarre to me. You're about to go in and spend money on clothes, but you won't do one pound for a breast cancer charity. Like check yourself and it was so awkward any time it happened i only had it once but then another girl who was on the door as well said that she had it too say hi vlog hi vlog hi I'm really oh no actually. no that looks perfect hi gotta go sorry it's very stressed because we're running late this is the top it's bench and the bow is supposed to be in the middle but i put it to the side because i think i prefer it like that and then little denim pleated mini and then some little black booties oh um eyelet bag let's go <laughs> I need to vlog. Okay, do I open it? I 
I am so tired. You can hear it in my voice and you can see it in my face. Like when I'm super tired, my eyes get really puffy. Okay, I'm going to work and this is what I'm wearing. I haven't worn Mimi's in a minute. I kind of wear them when I want to wear trackies, but like they're a nice thin trackie, if that makes sense. And then my loafers and this top that I got from Vivian's Vintage. We can have a little post-shoot debrief catch up after work because hopefully by then my voice will sound a bit more normal and I'll have a bit more energy. I can't even speak. <laughs> like a little cinnamon spice cookie butter crunch you know i told a little lie i said that i'd catch you up about the shoot when i came home from work last night but i walked through the doors and i was honestly dead to the world so you were not going to hear a peep out of me i think i went to sleep at like half eight i've got today and tomorrow off because the shoot and the sample sale fell on my normal days off so it's all sort of switched around and i'm feeling a little bit discombobulated about not being at work today but i am relieved i really just need to have like a slow chill day so i think i'm going to spend my afternoon editing this vlog i got my nails done this morning they they were like four and a half weeks old the girl was gross and i'm a bit embarrassed that i didn't get them done before the sample sale because if anyone would have seen she wasn't cute the way that i went to the nail salon with an inspo picture and came out with these is really funny basically they said it was going to be an extra 15 pounds for the nail art and i just do not have the funds right now to be spending extra on my nails like it's even kind of ludicrous that i get them done as it is but i am a serial nail and cuticle biter and the only thing that stops me is if i have manicure done Okay, high maintenance. The shoot was so much fun. Like, although there are stressful times and it's very tiring and it's a very long day, like, I still just love doing shoots. I think they're so much fun and the atmosphere is great. Also helps when the team are just, like, really nice, fun people. I had to be at the office for seven to go and get all the stuff to take to the shoot location, which was in East Dulwich. Everything went well and I'm really, really, really excited to see these campaign images. Like, I feel like I say this every time, but that was, like, 100% my favourite campaign to date that we've done. I think the twins, Gloria and Miriam, were such a vibe and then Katarina was such a vibe as well and I just really liked the concept around it and I'm just really really excited to see the final images. Also the shoots are so dangerous for my bank account because it always convinces me that I need something. I think there were honestly like five or six things that I was like I will not be able to breathe or survive if I don't own this when it drops. I have had uh, eye twitch which I'm pretty sure is stress induced for like the past week. I'm hoping that now like the stressful times are over it will start to die down. It's been really consistent for a week now and it is bothering me and if you can see it that is what that is. Let's talk about fabric. I've never been to fabric before it was kind of more studenty than i thought it would be and like there was like the odd guy in a shirt and i was like what's going on but the venue itself is super cool and like nice cool layout even just like cool in terms of aircon like i love a club with aircon midland and peach who were the djs we went to go see were on at the same time at 4 a.m so we were kind of dipping in and out of both rooms it got to half four and my legs were dead like at the shoot any opportunity i could i would sit down because my legs were dead from running around all day friday and saturday at the sample sale okay I think I'm gonna sit in bed and edit this vlog. Thank you for spending my week with me. This was like a more chaotic week in terms of like stuff going on with work, but fun nonetheless, I hope. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, click like, leave me a comment down below, click subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video.